the lord is teaching us do not love this world but this world will always tell us follow the desires of this world if we follow this world no kurikiri isi we will lose our soul tuzabura roho yacu if we follow god ni dukurikiri imana our soul will be saved the particular word of god for some time i did not understand the meaning it is only from another priest i heard this interpretation in the book of revelation chapter 22 verse 15 the word of god says outside are the dogs and sorcerers and fornicators and murderers and idolaters every word of god is teaching us those who practice sorcery those involved in fornication those who commit murder those who involved in idolatry those who are lying they cannot enter the kingdom of god is that heaven is for holy people to so zikwijuru ari rya abantu bintungane so those who committed sin they need to repent and confess in order to reach heaven the word of god begins with another thing saying dogs will not enter heaven we all know dogs cannot go to heaven can twe tuzikwimbwa zitazajya mu ijuru because dogs have no soul kubera ko imbwa zitagira roho so only humans who have soul umuntu wenyine ni ugira roho so only humans who are created in the image and in the likeness Umuntu niwe wenyine waromwe mu ishusho n'imisusire y'Imana. Then why specifically the word of God writes that dogs will not enter the heaven it means. Bivuga rero a human who acts like a dog does not deserve heaven. A human who be, behave like a dog. Umuntu ugira umuco nk'uwimbwa. What is the speciality of dogs? it will wave the tail to everyone who gives it food and it will bark at every stranger hanyuma imokere umunyamahanga it love those who love it ikunda abayikunda it hate those who hate it ikanga abayanga a human who love only those who love him is still in the level of a dog <laughs> it's also applicable to me mpadirero nawe byamubaho if i love only those who love me niba kunze abamukunda gusa if i help only those who help me agafasha abamufasha gusa i i am just like even dogs do that nimgarero nk'ibyo zirabikora i'm a human nawe no moon created in the image and in the likeness of god wakozwe waremwe mwishusho n'imisusire y'Imana i have to display the character of my heavenly father this is his character umuco we no wose this is matthew chapter 5 from 45 he gives sunlight he gives rain upon the righteous and the unrighteous in an equal measure if we kill those who kill our family members we are not christians sagu tura ba christ it's also applicable to me padri nawe biramureba the lord is clearly telling us imani ratugiriti this is luke chapter 6 from 32 if you love only those who love you what credit is that to you even sinners do the same sometime back mu myaka yashize i advised the jesus yagiri inama yesu It is very wrong to advise Jesus. Ni kosa rero cyane ukugira inama yezo. Because we are nothing before him. Kwako ntacyo turi kimbere ye. Out of my ignorance. Ariko kubera kutamenya. I advise to Jesus like. Yagira inama yezo. Jesus it was wrong. Yamgati yezo byari kosa. That you disappeared to heaven after 40 days of your resurrection. Kuba warasubiye mu ijuru nyuma y'iminsi 40 gusumaze kuzuka. You entrusted this heavy task of evangelization upon us. and we have miserably failed you wafashe igihe cyose utwigisha inkuru nziza ariko ubuzima bwawe turabwangiza cyane even now majority of the people they don't know about you ndetse nabantu benshi nibazuriwe if you have stayed back for long time after the resurrection you could convert the whole world i told jesus like this abwira yesa ati at least you could appear before pontius pilate gibuzagombaga kubonekera pilato after the resurrection umaze kuzuka 
and give him at least 3 slaps on his face ukamukubita byibuze inshesha tukumatama so that he may learn a lesson kugira ngo abashe kubona isomo so that he may not repeat the same mistake kugira ntazongera ukora ikosa so that he may know you were innocent and you are still alive kugira ngo umwereke ko wari umuziranenge kandi ukabukinariho I advise Jesus it was important that you appear before Herod and lift him in the collars in the air. Ukamufata mu mu mashati ukamushyira mu kirere. Keep him in the air for 2 minutes. Ukamuzamura mu kirere byibuze iminota ibiri. And drop him. Warangiza ukamujugunya hasi. No need to even say anything. Eh no ne byabaye. So that Herod may learn a lesson. Yatu byashaka gutuma byibuzari soma vanamu. And I advise Jesus. Abwira Yesu ati It was very wrong without telling anyone you just went up ati ni kosa ko arahise uzamukajya mu ijuru you could prove your power and your majesty wagomba kugaragaza imbaraga zawe nukungu gawe in front of your enemies and those who hated you imbere yabanzi bawe nabantu bose bagutoteje why you just disappear like that ese kubera iki wahise ugenda gutyo jesus told me like this yesu aramubwira ati that changed my life he told me my son who is Pontius Pilate who is Herod they are also my children I died even to save them I came not to defeat anyone but to save the souls of everyone ariko nagombaga gukiza roho za buri wese i am broken so that they should not be broken narishwe kugira ngo batijwa the lord is telling us imani natubwira iti lose your life uburubuzima bwawe and you will get it hanyuma uzongera ububone don't love this world and you will reach heaven take up that cross of suffering that cross of humiliation and you will be lifted by God as humans we are constantly tempted constantly tempted to take revenge we are constantly tempted to teach a lesson to those who hate us those who oppress us we are constantly tempted to do something harmful to those who harm us our master is teaching us even if you are harmed even if you are broken even if your heart is pierced bless them and heal them that is the lesson he wants us to imitate at the time god is glorified